Hey everybody, it's Steve Ritter again. So I, I've, I've got to do something I haven't done in, well, maybe almost a year now is uh, make dessert. So I'm not a big dessert guy. I like my sweets, ice creams, my kryptonite, but so but I don't uh, so I don't touch it too much. Um, I uh, uh, so I, I'm gonna make something. Um, I saw this recipe. Somebody mentioned something about making stuff in the crock pot. So uh, what I'm going to make today or try, I don't know how this is going to turn out. So it could be another fail, failure or, or a brilliant success, who knows. But uh, I'm going to make something I used to make when we'd go camping. And I had a, I had a cast iron Dutch oven and I would use coals and, and, and make that uh, dump cake. So uh, I had a friend of mine who, I guess it's a big Boy Scout thing that they'll do. Uh, and he kind of first told me about it, and then we finally kind of got into camping, and and I would that was a staple. Every time we'd go camping, I would make a dump cake. It's pretty easy, uh, and I'm gonna try the crock pot. So I don't know how it's gonna turn out. So I'm about to head off to work. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna cook this on low for about uh, six hours, probably. Let's see, hopefully that's not too long. Hopefully it's not scorched and black when I get back. So. Anyway, we'll see. So I'm going to flip the camera around, show you how I uh, just put it in. It's real simple. And I'm going to turn it on and go to work. And, and then I'll, we'll check back tonight through the magic of time and editing. I'm going to rip through the space-time continuum when I... It'll be, uh, it'll be evening and we'll see how it turned out. So you won't have to wait like I do. So anyway, uh, I'm going to flip the camera around. We'll, uh, we'll see what this is like. So stand by one. All right, we're back. So give this a try here. I'm gonna make an apple dump cake. So the first thing uh, I'm gonna get uh, some uh, big cans. These are uh, 20 ounce cans of uh, apple pie topping and filling. You could use cherry. I've made it before with cherry and with blackberry and things like that. Um, but uh, I like apple. Apple dump cake's pretty uh, pretty simple. It's a staple. So just kind of put this in first. When I, I'm looking to cover the bottom of the crock pot here. Pretty big crock pot. So I'm hoping this is going to work out. So I was on, I was thinking maybe I would only need one can, but no, I'm going to have to use two. So let's get this other can going here. And this is, this is probably the time I wish I had a programmable crock pot. I just, uh, enough doubts here. I'm just hoping that's, it doesn't scorch with as long as I'm, because I'm doing this sim tonight until six. And so by the time it takes me to get back to the, well, that's probably enough. I got probably about a inch of apple topping on the bottom here. Now as this heats up and the and the and the the liquid cooks out of the out of the apples, uh, it'll it'll percolate up into the cake mix. So I got just vanilla cake mix, just a nice uh, yellow. Uh, I think it's yellow cake mix. Just take it out, open it up without making a mess which is always a touchy proposition with me. Well, use my teeth. I need some scissors or something here, huh? Get a knife. Get the old Jedi knife. Cut this thing open, quit playing around with it. Look at that. It's kind of nice having a sharp knife around after now. It's been so long since I've had one. Just cut it open, and all I'm going to do is just uh, cover the cover the apples. Just try to spread it around and cover it all up. And I'm going to just use the whole bag. Now, again, this as these apples cook, the liquid kind of comes out. It'll kind of start cooking the. Uh, it'll kind of mix with the topping here. And that's how it works with the uh, Dutch oven. Now, 
with the Dutch oven, though, I, I, the, the question I have is because I have, I put coals on top of the top of it as well. So, kind of spread this around a little bit. Um, so I have heat on top, but I, I guess it's just the fact the whole crock pot, the thing is, uh, the heat is all inside it, I think. So again, we're, you're, you're gonna learn as much as I am here. Last thing is uh, some butter. So I got half a stick. Of course, you can never have too much butter, can you? Maybe on movie popcorn sometimes. You ever eat that, you know, you just get sick from eating so much popcorn, movie uh, popcorn. This has got too much butter on it. So all I'm gonna do is just cut little pieces off, little squares, little pats of butter, and just put them around the top here and uh, spread them around. And again, as it heats up, that butter will go down into the thing. So you have the apple cooking from below, the liquid coming through, and then the butter melting from the top. And that should provide enough liquid for that cake to kind of mix in there and bake. At least that's, that's the way it works with the Dutch oven, which I guess essentially this is. It's just, it won't be as hot. Slow cooker, huh? Kind of excited to see how this turns out. Now I told the ravishing Mrs. Ritter what I was gonna do today for you. And uh, she said, what are you gonna do with all that? And I was like, well, I don't know. I'll have a little bit of it, whatever. She goes, no, you won't. You're gonna eat the whole thing. And I said, oh, maybe. <laughs> uh, I said, well, maybe I'll take it to work. And uh, she said, yeah, that's that, that would be a better idea, so. Take it into work tomorrow for the folks at work. Uh, I think this is going to end up being uh, just right for the butter. If I use more butter, maybe I'll make thicker, use thicker uh, cuts of the pats here, but uh, I think this is going to work out fine. So just kind of spread the butter around, and it'll mix in. And then I'm going to put the top on and turn it on low. And go on to work, and then hopefully when I come back, I'll have some delicious apple dump cake waiting for me when I get home. Will that be dinner tonight? No, I know that's your next question. No, I'm gonna have I'm gonna have something else. So this will be dessert, though. So uh, again, through the magic of time and space, and rip through the space-time continuum. The next thing I'll be back. It'll be tonight. So we'll see you soon. Stand by one. All right, back from work. So let's see the moment of truth, see how this turned out here. Well, the cake cooked, but you see a, a little bit of scorch there. So I'm, it's uh, six o'clock, put this on about noon. So six hours is too long with this. Let me get my spoon out here and see. So the cake looks like it cooked through um, all the everything came through so I oops, got it fogged up again um, scorched a little bit there but uh, I, I'm gonna try a little bit of this and see what it see what it's like so uh, hmm, it's probably not a total loss so probably not six hours you don't need it six hours but I'll let you know how it tastes here in a second hold on stand by one all right, well, here's the moment of truth. So, you know, it doesn't look bad. It kind of looks like um, apple crumble. It smells great. You know, I love spiced apple, and that's that smell, spiced apple. So, the moment of truth. So, it's still pretty hot. Mm. You know what? I had my doubts. When I walked in and saw it, one little area kind of got scorched, so I won't eat that. But the rest of it, I mean, it's the 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 apple infused all through the cake, and of course the butter melting on top, and the apples. The cake's not crunchy. It's not like like really soft and light, but yeah, this reminds me of the camping, the dump cakes we had on the camping trips. That's tasty. This worked out real nice. I'm really pleased with this. I think probably 
90% of this is still good and that, that little black scorch part there I'll, uh, I'll, I'll get that off and then but there's not that much of it really as I look at it yeah it's just one little spot but the rest of it's good I, that's gonna I'm gonna get dessert out of this this is good this worked out real nice hmm hmm yeah so just uh, probably less than six hours obviously so probably check it probably be done I'm thinking you know check it at the at the uh, three to four hour point see how it's doing and um, the cake the cake here is is uh, it's it's uh, it's super moist it's like soaked through it's like uh, um, tiramisu kind of cake like like uh, espresso infused and the you know and the and the tiramisu that's about what this cake is like and it's, it's spiced and it tastes great with the with the apples mm -mm -mm. that's good that's a winner all right super simple dump cake hope you enjoyed it recipes down below and uh, do me a favor, leave a you know leave a comment. Let me know uh, some things, other things you'd like me to see try. I'd really like to hear from you because I'm getting tired of eating sandwiches. So uh, I might try some more dessert. Somebody mentioned something about bread in the crock pot. I think I'm gonna I think I might try that. See how that turns out. So anyway, this is Colonel signing off. Another episode of Crock Pot with the Colonel. We'll see you next time.